Dear Techmites, uh, I'm in London at the launch event of the Bloodhound project and I'm here with the fastest man on earth, Andrew Green, and I have the pleasure to ask you about this project and how we as Tech Mahindra could potentially get involved at this stage. Tremendously exciting for us. This is the public reveal of the car. This is the world's first 1,000 mile an hour car. Every single piece of engineering on this car is simply astonishing. The wheels are going to be rotating at 10,000 times a minute, 170 times a second. The wheel rims pull 50,000 G radially outwards. A bag of sugar here, one kilo bag, would exert a load of 50 tonnes. The jet engine from Eurofighter Typhoon, nine tonnes of thrust. The space where the Namo hybrid rocket will go, an extra 12 tonnes of thrust. The equivalent of 120 kilonewtons or 135,000 thrust horsepower, nine times the power of the Formula One grid. This car will be 20 kilometres away from a standing start in two minutes. The key overriding philosophy in this car is that we're not going to do a thousand miles an hour, we are going to do a thousand miles an hour safely. Every single bit of this car has redundancy built into it, every single piece is monitored. 500 sensors, twice as many as a Formula One car, we are monitoring everything. It is also, with 12 video cameras on board, going to be the world's fastest outside broadcast platform because we are streaming live video and live data on the internet. So can we get access to this data and help you analyze this because I understand this is an open platform idea that you're sharing with the world. Exactly. So could our tech mighties get involved in this? Most certainly. The whole idea is to have a hundred million people marking our homework and checking what we're doing every single time we run. Now the pressure is on us to do it right but that's as it should be. Every, everybody in the world with a computer, with a tablet, with a phone will be able to watch our runs, download our data. It's about getting people engaged with the innovation and the technology. It's about inspiring them about the technologies of the future and about allowing them to use that, to rise above where we are now, to develop the technologies of the future that will improve the world for all of us. And part of monitoring this is not only the safety of the car, there is the safety of the driver. This is a teamwork with me and the engineers. They need to know how I'm feeling. And actually, the world will want to know what it's like to be in there. So part of the technology in the car will be physiology monitoring for me. And here's where I think Tech Mahindra could make a real difference. This is going to be the most extraordinary, huge technology-focused audience in history. This is the Apollo moment for the 21st century and the driver's physiology data, Tech Mahindra can take that to the world. I will take that to my management and to my Tech Mighties and uh, we will get back to you, but I am so excited seeing this car and seeing the passion that you exhibit and uh, bring in new engineers of the future. I think our colleagues in India would be extremely fired up and willing to help you to rise with this. So all the best on your attempt. Lars, thank you very much. We'll see you in South Africa next year for a world record. I would love to. <laughs> This is an amazing opportunity for us to be part of a global initiative, to really be part of history and to push, position our brand amongst the leading brands in the industry. So please help me to support this and also make it part of our initiative to rise.